Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, True Vine. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord, True Vine. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Let us stand and go to the throne of grace. Hallelujah. Let us pray. Lord Jesus, we thank you for this day, Lord God. Thank you, Lord God, for waking us up this morning, Lord God, in our right mind, Lord Jesus. We thank you, God, for allowing us to make it here safely on today, Lord Jesus. We pray right now, Lord God, that you search every heart, every mind, Lord God. Get rid of everything, Lord God, that is not of you, Lord Jesus. Help us, Lord God, to focus and meditate on your word. Hallelujah. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for being able to make it this far, Lord God. Lord God, we couldn't do nothing without you. Hallelujah, Lord. We pray and ask that you forgive us, Lord, for every sin, God, everything that we've done that wasn't pleasing unto you, Lord. We pray that you forgive us right now, Lord Jesus. Make us white as snow, hallelujah, right now, Lord God. Lord Jesus, that we may be able, Lord God, to lift up your name with a clear conscience, hallelujah, God. We pray right now, Lord Jesus, that you bring Christ for word, Lord God, upon today, Lord God, that will edify the body, hallelujah, God, uplifting your kingdom, Lord Jesus, Lord God, and correcting every saint, hallelujah, and anybody that may need anything, Lord God, we pray that you open up the windows of heaven, hallelujah, God, and let it rain down, hallelujah, upon true vine, hallelujah, not only natural gifts, hallelujah, Lord Jesus, we pray to bless us with spiritual gifts. Hallelujah. Help us to be on one accord. Hallelujah, God. Help us to do your will, Lord God. We want to make it. Hallelujah, Jesus. We want to hear you say, well done. Hallelujah. Look into our hearts. Hallelujah. Correct us, Lord God. Reprove, rebuke. Hallelujah, Jesus. God, make us. Hallelujah. More like you, Lord God. Help us to breathe and speak and walk and talk like you, Lord Jesus. God, we want to be more like you in this evil time. Hallelujah. Continue to protect us. Continue to provide for us. Hallelujah. Continue to surround us with your angels, hallelujah, God, as we can travel the highways and byways, Lord God, continue to keep us in your unchanging hand, hallelujah, God, we pray that you go to every head of household, hallelujah, Jesus, Lord God, and touch, hallelujah, the hearts and the minds of those people, hallelujah, God, every saint, hallelujah, God, as we try to make heaven our home, Lord God, we're striving, hallelujah, God, in this 
dark and evil time, hallelujah, God, to make it, hallelujah, Jesus. We pray right now, Lord Jesus, that you bless the pastor, Lord God, anoint his voice, hallelujah, God. Lord, whatever word that you have come forth, hallelujah, God, open our ears, hallelujah, God, to receive it in our hearts, hallelujah, Jesus, to, to do it in your will, Lord Jesus. We thank you, Lord, hallelujah, you are, Lord God, everything unto us, Lord God, Alpha and Omega, hallelujah, the beginning and the end, Lord Jesus, we thank you, hallelujah, we're going to lift up your holy name, hallelujah, we're going to praise your name on today, hallelujah, God, glorifying you, hallelujah, we thank you, Lord God, for all things, in your precious name, Lord Jesus Christ, we pray, amen and amen, hallelujah. Praise the Lord, everybody. Praise the Lord, everybody. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, everyone. Hallelujah. As you remain standing, we're going to read our scripture. We'll be coming from Psalms, the 51st chapter. When you have it, say amen. And it reads, have mercy upon me, O God, according to thy love and kindness, according unto the multitude of thy tender mercies, blot out my transgressions. Wash me thoroughly from my iniquity and cleanse me from my sin. For I acknowledge my transgressions and my sin is ever before me. Against thee, thee only, have I sinned and done this evil in thy sight, that thou mightest be justified when thou speakest and be clear when thou judgest. Behold, I was shapen in iniquity, and in sin did my mother conceive me. Behold, thou desirest truth in the inward part, and in the hidden part thou shalt make me know, make me to know wisdom. Purge me with hyssop, and I shall be clean. Wash me, and I shall be whiter than snow. Make me to hear joy and gladness, that thy bones which thou hast broken may rejoice. Hide thy face from my sins, and blot out my iniquities. Create in me a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within me. May the Lord add a blessing to the readers of his word. Hallelujah. May it seat down into your heart, your souls, and your mind. Praise the Lord, everyone. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, everybody. Hallelujah. Come on, give God a hand. Praise. Praise Hallelujah. the Lord, everybody. Is everybody glad to be in Hallelujah. today? The Lord woke you up this morning with your mind. Hallelujah. He brought you to church. Come on, put your hands together. Give God a big praise. Hallelujah. Come on, we want to start the service off with a praise. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Hallelujah Jesus. Hallelujah, God. Hallelujah, Jesus. We praise you, God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, Jesus. Yes, God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. 
We want the service to be full of praise. We want everybody to praise the Lord throughout the service. Don't you sit on him. Don't you sit on the Lord on today. Give God your biggest praise. At this time, we're going to have a selection from our woman chorus choir. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm going to take a trip on that good old ship and we'll go. That sound real good. I'm going to take a trip on that good old gospel ship and we'll go Oh no, 
though they weren't, yes, this I know, cause I know that Jesus, yes, I know that Jesus, I said I know that Jesus, oh, yes, he will, after a while. I step in the furnace a very, very, very long time ago. There was Shadrach and Meshach, then there was a pentacle. I know, I know they weren't worried. Jesus will fix it, yeah. I tried him, I tried him for myself. My husband, he couldn't do it. My mother, she couldn't do it. My father, he couldn't do it. It was only my Jesus. It was only my Jesus. They tried to tell me no, but Jesus said, oh, yes. Jesus said, oh yes, Jesus said, oh yes, I know that Jesus, I'll lift my hands and worship, I'll lift my hands and praise, I'll lift my hands and praise, I'll give him all the glory, I'll give him all the honor, I'll give him all the praise, I'll give him all the praise, I'll give him all the praise. I know that Jesus, yes, I know that Jesus. Do you know the man named Jesus? Can you call the name of Jesus? I got down on my knees. I got down on my knees. I said, Lord, help me, please. I said, Lord, help me, please. I know that it was Jesus. I know that it was Jesus. I know that it was Jesus. It was nobody but Jesus. It was nobody but Jesus. I called on the name of Jesus. I called on the name of Jesus. I got down on my knees. I got down on my knees. I got down on my knees. I said, Lord, help me, Lord. Lord, help me, please. I know it was Jesus. Lord, you call that name. Come on and call that name. I know it was Jesus. I know it was Jesus. I know it was Jesus. I know it was my 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 Jesus. I know it was Jesus. I know it was Jesus. I know that it was Jesus. I got down on my knees. I got down on my knees. I said, Father, won't you please? I said, Father, won't you please? Father, won't you please? Father, won't you please? Nobody but Jesus. Nobody but Jesus. Nobody but Jesus. I will worship him. I'll give you all the glory. Yes, he will. Jesus will fix it. I know that Jesus will fix it. Nobody but Jesus. Yes, he will fix it. Yes, he will. After a while. Hallelujah. 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 Pony fix it. Pony fix it. Come on, everybody. Pony fix it for you. 
Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus. Hallelujah. He's going to fix it. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. My God will fix it. Hallelujah. Oh, Lord. Nobody like Jesus. Ain't nobody like the man named Jesus. Yes, I know that he will fix it. I counted it already done. I counted it already done. I'll lift my hands in worship. I'll lift my hands in I know you will. Yes, he know he will. Say Jesus. I say Jesus. Say Jesus. Say Jesus. What do you call him, Jesus? Well, I said Jesus. 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 Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus. Oh Jesus, 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 you're the lily of the valley, you're the bright and morning star, your name is Jesus, your name is Jesus, your name is Jesus, I call you, I call you, I call you, I call you. When I'm in trouble, when I'm in trouble, I run to Jesus. When I'm in trouble, I run to Jesus. Oh, Jesus, oh, Jesus. Just call him, just call him. Just think about him, just think about him. If you think about him, if you think about him, just call him, just call him, just call him, just call him. Oh, Jesus, oh, Jesus, oh, Jesus. Oh Jesus, oh Jesus, oh Jesus, oh Jesus, do you hear me? Do you hear me now? I said Jesus, I said Jesus, I said Jesus, I know him as a savior, I know him as a deliverer, I know him as my redeemer, as my redeemer, as my redeemer, my way maker is Jesus, my provider is Jesus. My healer is Jesus. My healer is Jesus. My deliverer is Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. His name is Jesus. His name is Jesus. What you say? What you say? He said, Jesus. 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 Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Oh, Jesus. 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 I feel like running. I feel like running. I feel like running. I feel like running. Cause Jesus, oh 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 Jesus. He's the lily of the valley. He's the bright and morning star. He's the bright. He's the bright. He's the bright. He's the bright. Oh Jesus, Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, if you know it, just say it, if you know it, just say it, why don't you stand on up, cause it's Jesus, why don't you get on up for Jesus, put your hands together for Jesus, put your hands together for Jesus, call Jesus, call Jesus, if Jesus, is Jesus, with the Holy Ghost, is Jesus, it's the Holy Ghost, we call Jesus. Say the Holy Ghost for Jesus. It's the Holy Ghost for Jesus. It's power, 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 oh power, oh power, oh power, oh power, oh power. He got up out the grave. He got up out the 
the grave with all power, 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 all power, all power. Call Jesus, 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 Jesus, oh Jesus, oh Jesus, oh Jesus. Oh Jesus, 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 I really need you, 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 Jesus, Jesus. Jesus will fix it for you. Don't you worry about a thing. Because my God will fix it. He may not come when you Hallelujah. want him, but he's right on time. Hallelujah. 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 Hallelujah, Jesus. Thank you for fixing it for me, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you for blessing me, Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen, amen. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord again, everybody. Praise the Lord again, everybody. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord again, everyone. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. At this time, I don't have to worry about a thing. 
You don't have to worry about a thing. Jesus will. Jesus will. I know he will fix it. Hallelujah. Come on, everybody, put your hands together. This time we're going to have our welcome address by Sister Lane. Give her an amen as she comes up.
that I make and I'm calling on his name because only in the name of Jesus can I be healed. I thank and I praise God for that. At this time, we would like to welcome our visitors. We don't have any return, any visitors, but we do have some returning visitors. And last week, Bishop Jackson claimed the visitors in Jesus' name, so which means you are now our family. Thank you, Jesus. So, Sister Whitfield, Sister Butler, thank you for being here with us today. And it's a good thing to see <laughs> Sister Wanda in the house. Thank you, Jesus. God is truly a good God. To God be the glory. Thank you, everyone, for continuous prayer for my family. God, he knows all and he sees all and he is a comforter. Hallelujah. We thank God for that. We thank God for our pastor. He has, a, he has a heart of gold. Hallelujah. And I thank and I praise him for his steadfast kindness. Hallelujah. And love that he continues to show us. And I thank and I praise God for the example that he's showing to us each and every day. That's from my heart. And I thank and I praise God for you, Bishop. I thank and I praise God for you. I thank and I praise God for you. I thank and I praise God. man of God who understands your trials and your tribulation and your circumstances. He just don't say I'm praying for you. He identifies with you. And when you have a person who identifies with you, they can reach out to you. They don't have to presently be there, but you know they've got your back and you know that they're praying for you. And I thank and I praise God for that. I don't take it lightly. I thank and I praise God for this journey. That Sunday school lesson meant a lot to me because we go through journeys if without those journeys, we wouldn't see the hands of God moving. Uh, tomorrow, tomorrow, rehearsal, Junior Youth for Christ and Youth for Christ will be rehearsing at 7 p.m. Also, uh, our worship service on Wednesday is at 7 p.m. Remember, remember that our service will be continuing. Please come on out, support the service. Our pastor's aide will be meeting this Thursday, January 20th at 7 p.m. And continue to remember your pledges. Our pastor's anniversary is fa uh, fastly approaching. Please turn in your pledges to Brother Codwell. Um, save the date, save the date. You are invited to celebrate the marriage of Lanisha C. Love and Kelvin D. Lane, June 18th, 2022, at 1 p.m. This will be held at Fort Eustis Officers Club. 2123 Pershing Avenue, and that will be at Fort Eustis. Please write that down in your calendar. Save the date, June 18th, 2022, at 1 p.m. Continue to pray one for the other. Pray my strength in the Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord. Give Sister Lane another hand praise for the announcement. At this time, we're going to have another selection by the Women's Chorus.
not my soul If you don't believe I've been reading All you've done To the Jordan stream I said Jordan River It's chilly and cold It chilled my body But not my soul I stepped in the water I stepped in the water I stepped in the water Stepped in the water Stepped in the water I stepped in the water I stepped in the water I went down in that water I went down in that water Anybody been to the river? Anybody been baptized? I stepped in the water I stepped in the water I stepped in the water Stepped in the water Stepped in the water Step in the water was cold Said the water was cold Said that water was cold Said that water was cold Chill my body Chill my body He chill my body He chill my body But not my soul Amazing grace That I sweep that sound that save a wretch, a wretch like me. I once was lost. I once was lost. Anybody here been lost? Anybody here been lost? But Jesus found me and he freed me at last. Anybody free at last? Anybody free at last? I stepped in the water. I stepped in the water. In the water, I stepped in the water. I stepped in the water. I stepped in the water. Repent of 
of your sin, yeah. Repent of your sin, yeah. Repent of your sin, yeah. Oh, my Lord. Repent of your sin, yeah. Oh, Lord. Repent of your sin, yeah. Oh, repent of your sin, yeah. And be Baptized. Oh, stepped in the water. I 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 said I stepped in the water. I stepped in the water. I stepped in the water. I went in that water. I went down in that water. I went down in that water. Oh, it chill my body. Oh, chill my body. But not my soul. Oh, not my soul. Uh-huh. If you don't believe, uh-huh. I've been yeah. redeemed. Uh-huh. Follow me down uh-huh. in the Jordan stream. Uh-huh. Said that Jordan River uh-huh. was still in cold. Uh-huh. Said it chill my body, but not my soul. Uh-huh. Said it chill my body. Uh-huh. Said it chill my body. Uh-huh. It chill my body. But not my soul, oh, not my soul. It's chill me cold. Said it's chill my body, but not my soul. I've been redeemed. I've been redeemed. I've been redeemed. Oh, I've been redeemed. It's chill my body. It's chill my body. Oh, chill my body, but not my soul. Oh, 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 I stepped in the water. 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 Anybody been in the water? Anybody been in that water? Have your soul been converted and you feel alright? I feel alright. Said I feel alright. I've been redeemed. Say I've been redeemed and water was cold. Said it chilled my body. Said it chilled my body, but not my soul. But not my soul. Say Jesus. Say Jesus. Say Jesus. He brought me out. Said he brought me out. Said he chilled my body, but not my soul. Hallelujah. Thank you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Said I stepped in the water. 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 Oh, I stepped in the water. I stepped in the water. And that water was cold. Said that water was cold. Oh, it healed my body. Said it healed my body. 
but not my soul. Uh -huh. oh, oh, oh. Wash away Thank our sins. Thank you, Nothing but the blood of Jesus. Thank you, Thank you, Nothing Jesus. but the blood of Jesus. Thank you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus.
Lord, everybody, at this time, we're going to lift up our offering, the baskets that I am holding and running Deacon Jordan is running is for your tithes and general offering. The basket that Deacon Tinsley is holding is for the speaker of today. Um, we ask that you stand with, with your offerings in your hand. Father God, in the name of Jesus, God, we thank you for the service thus far, God. We thank you for your many blessings. We thank you for your spirit and your Holy Ghost power right now. We ask that you will bless this offering right now, God. Bless those who have and bless those who do not have in the name of Jesus. Bless them to be able to give at the next appointed time, oh God. We ask that you will bless some 30, some 60, some hundredfold. In your name we do pray. Let everyone say amen. amen. Service is now in charge of the ushers. Praise the Lord, everyone. Praise the Lord again, everyone. At this time, we're going to have a selection from the choir. After the choir, the service will be in the hands of our wonderful pastor, Bishop Terry Jackson. Give him an amen as he comes.
Jesus, we thank you right now for blessing us. Thank you for being so kind, so merciful to us right now. Realize about you, Lord, we cannot do nothing. And God, we are standing in need of prayer. It was you that woke us up this morning, closing our right mind, giving us activities of our limbs, let your bread and wound through our veins. You spare us to see a day that we won't see again by your grace and mercy. We pray that you forgive us of our sins and our not of sins. 
purge, creating us a clean heart. Renew the right spirit within us right now. We thank you for everybody on the sound of my voice. We thank you right now for the people that are watching this live. Touch their heart, soul, and their mind. If they need anything, God, come through their rescue. Touch right now, deliver and heal. Set free right now, because we know that you're able to do all things. Nothing too hard for you. We are leaning and depending on you. We trusting in you, God, because you're a God that cannot lie. You promise, and we're gonna, not going to stagger at the promise of you. We give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. In Jesus' name, we do pray. Amen and amen. Amen. May God bless you. Have a most smile upon you. Because God, he's been good. To each and every last one of us. In the name of Jesus Christ, we thank you. Thank you for the women's chorus singing the beautiful songs of Zion. Hallelujah. I'm so glad when they said unto me, let us go into the house of the Lord. I'm like the psalmist, if it had not been for the Lord who was on my side. I can say, I ain't going to say now, the Israel said no. Bishop Jackson can say, if it had not been for the Lord who was on my side. When the enemy came in, they would have been swallowing me up. But I thanks be to God, I got a God that told the enemy to step back once again. Hallelujah. He's my battle axe. Hallelujah. He's my shield. He's my buckler. I give honor to my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, who is the author and the finisher of our faith. He is the first and the last, the beginning and the ending. He's Alpha and Omega. This is a true saying. He got the first saying, and he also got the last saying in our lives. You can't do nothing without him. You think you can, but it's impossible to do anything without him. In him, you live, you move, and you have your being. I get on to my Lord and Savior Jesus Christ once again, who is the author and finisher of my faith. Hallelujah to God, who already been the example for me. Thank God for my beloved wife being with me in Jesus' name. Thank God for all the deacons, all the missionaries, the saints, the choir. This road is not an easy road. It's a good road, but it's not an easy road. <laughs> Hallelujah to God. You got to suffer on this Christian journey. Hallelujah to God. When the Holy Ghost step into you, the battle just begun. The scripture is right. Put on the whole armor of God that you may be able to withstand the wiles of the devil. Also, that when you've done all that you can, stand anyhow. There come a time in your life you can't do nothing but stand there. Hallelujah. You stand there and take all the blows from the enemy because you can't do nothing else. You've done all that you can, and sometimes you just got to take it. Hallelujah to God. And God makes sure that you're able to take it. At least you ain't stoned to death. The apostles were stoned. Can you imagine just standing there taking the blows? Just standing there, ain't fighting back. They throwing stones at you. Hallelujah. When they say words don't hurt you, that's a lie from the pit of hell. Words will tear you to pieces. You know what I mean? I'll tear you up. And one thing, as Christians, we're always abominable. We're always subject to be hurt. I'm telling you right now, this will put your guards down. Well, I'll put my guards up, then you ain't going to love. People that love always getting hurt. So you might as well put your hurt bag on. You always... Gonna get hurt. Why are you getting 
getting hurt because you love. Love don't have no shield. Love don't have no boundaries. Oh, y'all ain't talking to me here. The love I'm talking about don't have no boundaries. You did me, you could do me again. Oh, y'all ain't talking to me. I'm the time you slap me, you slap me again. Because I'm be right there for you to slap me again. Because I ain't going nowhere. Church of people of God, you got to understand, this battle is not yours. It belongs to the Lord. Hallelujah to God. God is good. How the weather out there? Is it snowing? Snow gone, ain't it? Oh, we staying. <laughs> ain't no ice. You <laughs> this guy here, so we don't do you know. No, 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 no. I ain't see no snow on neither one of y'all head in here. We in a building that is rainproof. <laughs> Hallelujah to God. It's just, it's just car where it feels so good to be home. I see how the psalmist said, how can you sing in a strange land? <laughs> but when you got your own, you can come in here and do whatever you want to do. You can praise God all you want to. This is a safety house. A house of refuge. When you need some help, just come in here and just sit down. That's all you got to do. You ain't got to do nothing but sit in here. Just come in here and sit. You're going through problems with your family, going through problems with your spouses, going through problems with your children. Just come to church and just sit in here. And let the spirit just rest on you because it's here. It's not about all that talking. Just sit and let the spirit rest on you. Through your turmoils, he give you a peace of mind. So you won't make no radical decision. It just lay on you, rests on you. Before you know, you started feeling good. Hallelujah to God. Because sometimes you need the spirit to rest on you. Because you can catch hell from everywhere. You ain't got to be in the world to catch hell. You catch hell right in your house. Oh, y'all ain't talking to me. Yeah? Hallelujah. Why are you catching? Because the devil is a spirit too. I'm going to get into my topic. But God is good. Well, don't worry about it. Our topic is coming. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. The carpet is coming. You know what I mean? But one thing about it, you got a place for a carpet. You're not homeless. You're not wandering in the wilderness. It feels so good not to be wandering in the wilderness. If you understand what I'm saying. It feels so good not to wander in the wilderness. Because when you wander in the wilderness, you always got to move the Ark of the Covenant. You always got to move it and find another place for it. But when you got your own home, you can place it there permanent. I know you use a temple. I know you say, I'm the temple of the living God. Yeah, we know that. 
Hallelujah. We know you the temple of the living God. Hallelujah. But God don't dwell in you always because you don't act accordingly to his will. Always. But when God acts in his own pavilion, he sit here, he can do what he want to do. He can move when he want to move because I don't know you, he know you. The preachers don't know you, God know you. That's why the church got to be led by the Holy Ghost. Because the Holy Ghost feed the people. To their needs. God know everybody in here. He know your needs. So he makes sure that the man of God bring forth what you need. Not what you want. Because you want a million dollars. But you need to be saved. <laughs> Why not get both? <laughs> <laughs> Why did I get the million dollar and save? You can get them both. Like, if God be fire, he more than the whole world. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. The cows on a thousand hill belong to him. When you got Jesus, you got everything. Amen. Hallelujah. So you got something that money cannot buy. All right, give me Galatians, the sixth chapter. I'm not going to be running around, think. I'm so glad to be in the house. Y'all look good back there. Everybody got their Bibles back there. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> you know, because, you know what I mean, we, we live stream, you know what I mean? When you, you know, we was live, but now we live stream. <laughs> 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 they, they see everything. <laughs> they pick up everything. <laughs> I remember, I remember you got cameras, but then you got some real cameras. You know, you got cameras, but you do, you got some real cameras. I remember one time I was, uh, I drove to the shipyard and I parked in the parking lot. And uh, when I parked in the parking lot, I got in the car with a couple boys. You know what I mean? Back in the day, you know what I mean? Got in the car with a, with a couple boys. When I got in the car, a couple of boys, they were doing things that they shouldn't have been doing. But I didn't do it. You know what I mean? I'm just talking to them. You know, maybe shoot the breeze. You know what I mean? Got in the ship, y'all walked through the gate. About two hours later, supervisor told me to come to the security office. So I walked to the security office. They called me in. And they came in and told me to sit down. I went to security office, I went to set out. They set the screen TV up in front of me. I was sitting in the brother car, and you know the shipyard badge. Y'all know the badge. The badge ain't no bigger than that. But they blew it up to a 65 inch. <laughs> the numbers was on my thing with that being. <laughs> I was in the car, but I'm just saying the camera that they had zoomed in the car and got my badge number. That's how they identified me. One of the brothers had a cigarette. That cigarette about bigger than his mic. <laughs> I said, I said, great day. <laughs> but what I'm saying, 
what I'm saying, when they zoom in on you, bro, they zoom in on you. You know what I mean? The whole over there, the shipyard area zoom in. Just, just, just in case, just in case y'all brother want to try to sell some drugs, you've been busted all the time. And don't even know it. They just let you go. All right, they ain't my topic, just in case you want to do that. Make a quick buck. <laughs> uh, Esther, the third chapter. And Esther, the eighth chapter. Galatians 6, chapter of Galatians, and mean in Esther, the third chapter. Third chapter and the eighth chapter. Y'all pray for the young man. We're going to be here long today. What time you got, Larry? 21 minutes before before two. Oh, we be out of here. Lord, the lay is coming. Two o'clock, 2.15, we're on your way home. Everybody looking at me like all oh, they lift. When I say they lift their head up, I say, yeah, okay. Who you think you talking to? <laughs> I know you by now. <laughs> and I'm looking back at you, and I know you by now. <laughs> uh, I know y'all, I know y'all funny, right? <laughs> okay. <coughs> Galatians, the sixth chapter, beginning at the first verse, the first two verses in that. Be please. Brethren. Brethren. If a man be overtaken in a fault. Oh, Lord, have mercy. If a man be overtaken in a fault. Ye which are spiritual. Ye which are spiritual. Restore such an one in the spirit of meekness. Restore such a one in the spirit of meekness. Considering thyself. Considering thyself. Lest thou also be tempted. Lest thou also be tempted. Bear ye one another's burdens. Bear ye one another's burden. And so fulfill the law of Christ. So you can fulfill the gospel law. Amen. Read on. Give, give me um, um, read the third verse too. For if a man think himself to be something. If a man think himself to be something. When he is nothing. When he is nothing. He deceiveth himself. He deceiveth himself. We don't. But let every man prove his own work. Let every man prove his own work. And then shall he have rejoicing in himself alone. Then he shall, have he shall rejoice in himself alone. And, and not in another. And not in another. The last one. For every man shall bear his own burden. For everyone shall bear, every man shall bear his own burden. I'm going to deal with that a little bit. I'm really coming out of the second verse. Bear ye one another burden and so fulfill the law of Christ. Bear somebody. Please bear somebody. And we're not talking about bearing somebody. I'm talking about to support, to uphold them, to carry them. If it's used, it's in the same predicament. To maintain them. Now, when you bear somebody, can y'all hear me? Somebody I say, I talk away from the mic. Y'all can't hear me. Uh, I'll put the mic in my hand. Because I do turn around. When you bear somebody, it don't have to be a reason. You bear somebody to fulfill the law. And the law is love thy neighbor as thou love thyself. Treat others as you want to be treated. That is the law. When you bear somebody else's burden, then you fulfilling the law. Oh, talk to me. And here... He said, brother, if any man overtaken in a fault, not slip and fail, overtaken. Other words, something overtook you. You didn't voluntarily give it up. 
So you've overtaken with a fault. Paul wrote this. He gave you a, he, 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 he kind of make it look sound real good when you say fault, but it is sin. He just made it sound real good. You know what I mean? So it won't, look, it won't hurt you too bad. Right. Right. <laughs> He didn't want to hurt you too bad, but if you're overtaken by sin, he said, ye that are spiritual, uh, talk to me, ye that are spiritual, restore one in the spirit of meekness. In other words, what he's saying here, if I know that you're overtaken with a sin that you is doing, I don't have the reason to go and talk about it. See, people talk about what you're doing. That's not a spirit of meekness. Amen. Then the one that is spiritual, it says, the one that is spiritual, then the scripture says that everybody is not spiritual. So if I'm overtaken with a fault and you're talking about me, then that's an indication that you're not spiritual. Amen. Because you would to do it with meekness. Because what you're talking about could hurt me, even though I know it's true. Since you know somebody's in sin, that don't give you the right to talk about them because they're in sin. Because you got to consider thyself. Do you hear me now? Because everybody in here got something wrong with them. So it's kind of hard to judge somebody when you ain't clean yourself. Everybody's overtaken with fault. It ain't got to be the same fault, but it can be a fault in your life. Oh, y'all ain't talking to me. And you got to do it with love. At least also you be Tempted. That's right. yeah. You ain't strong all the time. Right. You ain't Samson all the time. Right. And Samson was the strongest man on earth. But eventually he was overtaken. Right. Oh, y'all ain't talking to me here. Right. Hallelujah. He was a man of natural. Hallelujah. How grew. Kill a bear with his own hands. Kill thousands with a jawbone. Non-stop. But eventually he was overtaken with a foe. Right. It doesn't matter how strong you are. Eventually the devil going to get a hold to you. Right. Oh, y'all ain't talking to me here. When you keep going the same route. Because... Samson's daddy say, leave it alone. Samson's parents say, leave it alone. But he went on in the house because he's Samson. But that's not my text. I'm dealing with burn one another. I'm going to come back to it. For the man think of himself to be something when he is nothing. Let's get to this point, then I'm coming back. Hallelujah. When you get to the point that you're so spiritual that you think you cannot be deceived, you're deceiving already. Then the Bible says you ain't nothing because you think you can't be deceived. Yes, you can be deceived. Have anybody been deceived? Oh, yeah, I got so I forgot. What kind of church did I go to? I forgot. Uh, I forgot. I got. We got a church full of John the Baptist. Our church full of with John the Baptist. You know what I mean? Full runner. You know what I mean? You know, we ain't no about this John. The Holy Ghost ain't, the Holy Ghost ain't jumped in your womb. Do I got any John the Baptist in here? Man, I'm thinking something where he's in nothing. Then he said, let every man prove his own work. Right. Then shall he have rejoiced in him alone and not in another. Don't get that twisted. 
where he said, bearing one another. When he was saying, here, I'm coming back to you. Let me get throw this out so you will get confused here. When he said, burn his own work, that's when he stand before the Lord himself. When Jesus is going to say, well done, that good and faithful servant. But they're going to ask you, did you bear one another burden? That, that is one of your works. It's burn one another. Bishop was right. Everybody in here needs somebody. Amen. 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 This, is no, this ain't no solo trip. The church is not solo. Right. One body but plenty members. Right. That indication that we got to work together and love and unity. Right. So we got to bear each one of us burdens. Right. I could twist my ankle but that'll get my head to go forward but the head can't go nowhere without the ankle. Right. Even though it's the head but the ankle is holding it back. Oh y'all yeah, ain't talking about that shows you how powerful somebody's in the body. Y'all right, right. listen to me here. Right, right. Everybody is powerful in the body. So what you ain't rushed, so what you ain't the shovel, but you're still powerful because you can hold the shovel back. The church progress, not individual lease. Because the one that is spiritual got to bear the infirmity of the weak. So you can't never leave your body. Ain't never seen a head just jump off and get to going. Because they don't like the foot. I don't care how dysfunctional the body is, the head, everybody got to stay together to work it out. You all right, baby. I see it. Put your sweater on. Go ahead, bear her burdens. Get up, take the <laughs> See? See? And here, see, you got to understand, the devil come to steal, kill, and he come to destroy. Yes. Hardly. See, and you don't never know what position you hold in the church. Even though you look like you ain't nobody, you'll never know when the time God going to use you because you're in the right position. See, because the devil done already made a decree. <laughs> see, see, and here I'm bringing in See, Mordecai and Esther was a good example of bearing one another burden. That's right. See, hallelujah. See, 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 Esther, hallelujah, was promoted in the king palace. You know what I mean? Hallelujah. But yet she was a Jew. Oh, y'all ain't talking to me here. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. She was a Jew, but she was promoted into the king palace. And which, everywhere that you go, God always finds favor in you. And he makes sure that the enemy finds favor for you. And Esther was in a enemy camp. Oh, y'all can talk to me. Yeah. But yet, God found favor. Make sure that the king found favor for that beautiful young lady. Even though she was an enemy to him. Hallelujah to God. And then they, here come Mordecai. Hallelujah. Esther is already in the house. Y'all know the story, but I'll just tell you a little bit about it. And here come Mordecai. Mordecai are coming. And here come Haman, the same old spirit today. Same spirit. King, that man did never bow. Check this out. Mordecai was a man that honored God. <laughs> they didn't say that the children didn't bow. They said Mordecai didn't bow. Right. See what I'm saying? Mordecai had to stand up for his people. That's right. 
See, when you stand up for your people, even though the people is wrong, because the people bow, but Mordecai didn't. He didn't get mad at them. He did his job. Y'all ain't talking to me here. You hear? He didn't talk about his people. He stood up for his people. He said, I'm not going to bow. Somebody got to stand for you. When you can't stand, somebody got to help you stand. See, Mordecai was a man that was able to stand for the people at that given time. He didn't bow. And here come that devil. Went to the king and told him, we need to write a letter. You got these people. He didn't say Mordecai. He hated Mordecai. He wanted to kill him with his bare hand, but he couldn't do it. But he went to the king and said, these people. See, look at here. What you talking about, Bishop Jackson? When True Vine, one of the members of the church act up, they ain't going to say your name. They're going to say True Vine member. Do you hear me now? They belong to True Vine, Apostolic Church of Christ. That Bishop Jackson number, they ain't going to call your name out individually. They're going to use you as a group. Even though they want to kill you personally, but they can't. And here, the king went to the king and told him about these people that wouldn't bow. We need to write a decree. And then he write a decree. Hallelujah to God. Give me, give me Esther, the third chapter. Haman did spies Mordecai. He couldn't stand him. I command you to bow, and this Mordecai, he bowed not. He didn't even reverence you. Hallelujah to God. But what we need to do, hallelujah, we need to, we need to do something. And when Mahama saw that Mordecai went down, went bowed, hallelujah to God, he, he, he went to a rage. He went to a rage. And he had to go to the king. Hallelujah. The seventh verse says what? Seventh verse. In the first month. In the first month. That is the month Nisan. Uh-huh. In the twelfth year of King Ahasuerus, they cast Pur, that is the lot, before Haman from day to day and from month to month mm -hmm. to the twelfth month, that is the month Adar. And Haman said unto King Ahasuerus. He said unto the king Ahasuerus. There is a certain people. There are certain people. Scattered abroad. Hallelujah. Even though Mordecai didn't bow, but he said, told the king, there are certain people. Because he couldn't go to with one man. You mean one man got you doing this? So he had to come with a plot. Oh, Y'all talking to me here. So he went to the king to deceive the king to kill Mordecai. In order to kill True Vine, he had to kill the whole church. Oh, y'all, 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 y'all must ain't with me here. See, in order to kill me, they got to kill you. Because we connected together. We're not separate. We might act separate, but we ain't separate. We all are one body working together to make heaven our home. You can't go unless I go. That's the motto that you should have. I'm not going nowhere till my sister go with me. We got to learn how to bear one another burdens. Give me a few minutes. And what did he say? There are certain people scattered aboard. And dispersed. And dispersed. Among the people. And look at here, dispersed among the people. Read on. In all the promises uh -huh. of thy kingdom. And the promise of that king. And their laws. And their laws. Are diverse from all people. Uh -huh. Their laws are diverse from all people. Mm -hmm. They different. Right. They don't believe what we believe in. Right, right. That's right. 
Why their law is different from our law? <laughs> so it's all right to be a separate church. We diverse. We different. It's all right to be different because God said be different. He said be peculiar. Read on. Neither keep they the king's law. Neither they keep the king's law. Neither do they keep man law. We don't keep man's law. That's man's law. They don't keep your law. No, we don't. The apostles said to themselves, hallelujah, I'd rather obey God than man. Man always trying to kill God's law. God always, well, the man always want to stop people from serving the Lord. That's right, right, right. See, the man law, Lord has scandalized Christians. Yes, sir. Amen, amen. Don't want you to use the name Jesus. Right, that's right. That's a fact. That's man law. Yes, sir. Talk about it. You go in the courtroom, you better not say Jesus. That's right. You say a prayer, you better not say Jesus Christ. They're always against the law of God. Yes, That's right. That's a fact. Oh, y'all. Yeah. That's a fact. And they say, read on. Neither they keep the law. Therefore, what? Therefore, it is not for the king's prophet uh -huh. to suffer them. It's not for the king to suffer them. Mm -hmm. Read on. If it pleases the king. If it pleases the king. Let it be written. <laughs> write it down. That they may destroyed. Look at him. Look at him. Because one man wouldn't bow. Right. That's right. That's right. One man wouldn't bow. That's right. Now they will try to kill millions. Go ahead, sir. Do you hear me now? And Mordecai knew that he was connected to his people because he was a Jew. Right. See, this is not an individual battle. See, sometimes, look at here, I'm taking care. Sometimes you got to stand alone in your own family. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. When they come against somebody in the body of Christ and it's your family, you got to stand and don't bow. Yes, sir. Right, right, right. Amen, amen. Right, right. That's right. Oh, I can't get no That's witness. Right. I can't get amen. I can't get no amen. Yeah, in here. Right. Now I'm gonna get a speaker here. Say amen. Yes, sir. Uh, you right about it, sir. Every time I say I'm gonna press the button. Amen. Right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Hallelujah. If it pleased the king, let us written and, and be destroyed. They say, destroy them. Right. And the Bible said the devil come to steal, kill, and he come to destroy. Right. He trying to allow nature. to. He trying to take you off the face of the earth. That's right. That's right. Read on. And I will pay 10,000 times. Look how much money this man willing to pay. I'm willing to pay 10,000 out of my own pocket. Mm -hmm. He's desperate to kill you. That's right. That's right. That's right. <laughs> People got asthma. No, the doctor said if you take another drink, or you know, their lungs is messed all up, you take another drink, you might die. In order to kill you, they'll take that drink. Let's get high together. No, they're going to die. But in order to kill you, it's worth it. You know what I mean? See, God already got a plan because God already spoke Malachi, hallelujah. See, you know, see, see, see when, when, when the enemy come in to, to destroy you, God already got a plan to destroy the enemy. Only thing you got to do is just obey his law. Because Haman so going to get something for Mordecai. I'm going to hang him. Right. That's right. Talk about it. That's right. I'm going to hang him. I'm going to give this guy. I'm going to hang this man. That's right. You know what I mean? Hallelujah. But you don't know when the enemy come in like a flood. Right. Right. See, right. see, you don't never know when is your season. You're right, Bishop. Amen. That's right. That's right. See, That's right. 
sometimes it's not your season. Your season, see, everybody can't be in the forefront. It's not your season. When it's your season, God will tell you to step forth. Ten thousand. What else? And I will pay ten thousand talents of silver uh -huh. to the hands of those uh -huh. that have the charge of the business. Yes, Lord. To bring it into the king's treasuries. Oh, look at here. Look at here. Look at here. Money. See, you try to get that money. Right. Uh -huh. See, there ain't nobody enemy now. Let me, take, let me throw this in there. Why it hit my mind? You know, man, it just hit my mind right quick. You know, man. So, so you know, the church, church need money. Right. Church need money. You know I mean? That don't give you no excuse to pay the lotto. <laughs> don't go on and get that pick three, four. The mega bucks. And all that kind of stuff. You know what I mean? The you, you all, you all in shell service station. <laughs> All there by BJ's. Right. <laughs> and then you got a lookout partner. <laughs> hurry, hurry up. Play the one right at the door. <laughs> set up for a set up. Right. Read on. And the king took his ring from his hand. And the king took his ring from his hand. And gave it to Haman. And gave it to Haman. The son of Hamet the the uh -huh. the Agagite the Jews the Jews enemy uh huh and the king said unto Haman uh huh the silver is given to thee yes Lord the people also people also to do with them you do as it seemeth good to you thee. do what but pleasing you to you to right. these people that's wow. right that's what he said I'm gonna give you a ring I'm gonna give you authority which is an enemy to the church right right, right, right. I'm giving the enemy authority to do whatever they want to do to you. This is a decree. The king gave him a ring. Oh, Lord. To make it seal. Haman, do whatever you want to do to them people. What seems is good to you. Whatever turn you on to make you happy, do it. Look what kind of condition that you was in. Because you serving God. We don't. Then were the king's scribes called mm -hmm. on the 13th day the th of the first month. Yeah. And that was written according to all that Haman had commanded unto the king's lieutenants. Got the lieutenants. And to the governors. He got the, Lord have mercy. He got the lieutenants. He got the governors. Yeah. Where we going now? Mm -hmm. You see where we going at? He got the lieutenants. He got the governors of the nation. Right. Everybody, read on. Everybody, you got to realize the governors, everybody, the president is always against God's law. That's right. That's Ain't right. nothing new. That's right. They're closed down. Look at the Think about it. Think about it, beloveds. They're closed down the church, but they won't close down ABC store. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Do you hear me now? Everything is counterattack to God's people. That's right. You're talking right. But I'm like Mordecai. I'm not going to bow. All right now. If I have to stand alone. Yes, sir. Because somebody got to stand for Christ. Yes, sir. Oh, y'all ain't hear me now. Come on now. Read on. And to the governors. And to the governors. That were over every province. Over every province. And to the rulers. To the rulers. Of every people. Every people. Of every province. Every province. According to the writing thereof. Uh-huh. And to every people. Every people. After their language. I'm going to make sure that everybody can read it in their own language. I don't care what language you have. I'm going to make sure it's written in your language. That's to right. kill the Jews. That's right. That's right. That's right. Kill them, people. That's right. Kill them. Mm -hmm. Read them. After their language. After their language. In the name of King Ahasuerus. Uh -huh. 
was it written? And it was written. And sealed. And it sealed. With the king's ring. With the king's ring. And a letter was sent. And the letters were sent by post. To the post. Into all the king's provinces. Mm -hmm. To destroy. Lord have mercy. To kill. To destroy. To kill. And to cause to perish. To cause to perish. All Jews. All Jews. Both young. Both young. And old. And old. Little children. Little children. And and women in one day in one day on the 13th day to the 13th day of the 12th month of the 12th month which is the month Adar oh, Lord have and mercy. to take the spoil take the spoil of them of them for a prey for a prey and then they got the nerve to go home and sit down and take a drink yeah yeah wow that's right the Bible say after he wrote the decree and sealed it with his ring, go out and kill the children, the women, the boys, the girls. Then they go home and drink and party because they killed you. Right, right. Right, right. Right. Ain't nothing the devil. But Mordecai bear the burden. God already had Esther in the palace. All oh, y'all hear me now. Mm -hmm. yeah. See, Esther laying back in the palace. Mm -hmm. Don't know what's happening. Right. But God got her there for a reason. Yeah, right. Oh, y'all talking to me here. Right. And sometimes you can be at the door ushering in your time. God got you at the door for a reason. You can't understand what's going on. Just stay at the door. Stay right there. That's right. Kill everybody. Mm -hmm. And the Bible said he sat down and then he drank. Mm -hmm. See, see, one thing about a decree, it can never be reversed. Once a decree and the king seals it with his ring. I don't care he changed his mind. Right. It can never be reversed. Right. So as of today, it's still written. That's right. <laughs> kill the children. Kill the women. Kill the boys. Destroy them. Annihilate them. Wow. Hallelujah. So we can party and drink. I can't party and drink while they live it. So kill everybody. The decree is still here. It cannot be reversed. The devil come to steal, kill, and to destroy. So learn it's not going to never be reversed. Because it's been sealed with a ring. I can't get no way. Is it, give me another seal. Is it Daniel? Daniel? Yeah. Is it Daniel 6 chapter? What is it? That the king made another? No, look, come on, let's come on, move with me. Daniel. 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 When he was going in the lion's den, where were they? Is it 6? Where it was? Where we at? The sixth chapter. Start at the fifth verse. What does it say? Daniel, the sixth chapter, beginning at the fifth verse. Then, said these men, then say, speak it up. Then say these men. We shall not find any accusation against this Daniel. We shall find any accusation against this Daniel, except we find against him concerning the law of his God. Ain't that something? Ain't that something? They ain't say the law of the land. They say the law of God. Hallelujah. When you want to make the world mad, you want to make the devil mad, you want to make the government mad, you want the princes mad, do God's will. My Lord. So they got to find something against God's law. Oh, I know y'all got to see. 
see, see somebody got a barrel uh, right in the building. Building, you know what I mean? Hallelujah. The law said, uh, hallelujah, hallelujah, told Daniel hallelujah, that you buy a bow. Read us what it say. The president, princes, summoned together and said to the king Darius, live forever? Gonna, gonna, you, you, gonna pump him up. King Darius, you live forever? But I say, all the presidents of the kingdom. All king, the presidents of the kingdom. The governors, yes. The governors. Yes. And the princes. Same people. The counselors. The governors, the counselors. The captains. The captains. Have consulted together. They got together again. To establish a do royal. You think, do you think, don't you know that the president, the judges, all of them get together and make decisions? We got Republican and Democrat. Don't you know they're working together? They got you thinking that they're working against each other. They're working together against God's law. Nobody stood up and said, no more homosexual, less marriage. Republican and Democrat. Anything occasion against God's law. And that's one of God's law. A man sleep with another man like he do a woman, yes, kill him. Yes, so they had to find something against God's law. Boy, I'm preaching in here. Yes, sir. Come on with it. Close the churches down. We got COVID. Right. The governors got together. Right. Don't you go in that sanctuary and right. praise God. That's right. But somebody can't bow. That's right. Amen. Somebody got to say. Yes, somebody got to stand against the governor of this whole world. Yes, Amen. Amen. I don't expect everybody to bow. But somebody cannot bow. That's right. Somebody out of the group got to stand up. Yes, sir. That's right. Amen. 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 What else to say? Have consulted together. Have consulted together. To establish a royal statute. Ain't this a royal statute? And to make a firm decree. A firm decree. That whosoever <laughs> shall ask a petition. Of any God or man for 30 days. Look at here. Look at here. Now you're trying to tell me I can't pray to Jesus now. Right, right. I can't pray to Jehovah. Right, right. Jehovah Jireh. Nietzsche. I can't pray to him. The God of I am Abraham and Isaac and Jacob. The one that said I am, I am. The one that brought me out, I can't call his name. I can't praise his name. And God told me to worship no other God before thee. Now you telling me I can't call his name. You telling me I can't worship him. The devil is a liar. Yes, sir. And you wrote a decree. A firm one at that. Going to the apostolic church. Right. See, they in there gathered around. That's right. mm -hmm. yeah. Where is your mask? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's right. Why you ain't got it on? Right. Why you ain't six feet apart? Why, why, why? Yes, the governor stood up, told the church what they got to do, yes. but then tell the ABC store what to do. Somebody got to stand. Oh, y'all ain't with me here. Come on, there. Come on, with us. Got the bear. One another. Another decree. I done messed up, didn't I? No, sir. But listen to what I'm saying. See? On a warrant person, then bow. That's right. That's right. So don't think it hot that you didn't that you bow. It was for you to bow. It for the person 
who was spiritual not to bow. Oh, see, the one that is spiritual. See, you bow because you ain't spiritual. So the one that is spiritual got to bow. He the more shunda. Yes, he kama. He the more kandia. Yes, I kanda. Yomo kandi yaka. God will bear. He the more soka. He'll give me stuff to bear. Mola shaka. Yomo no kandida shunda. He the more shikya. Hallelujah. Jesus. You always got a ram in the bush. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I guess I'm preaching to myself. Hallelujah. What does it say? That's it. Shall be cast. Yes. Ask a petition of any God or man for 30 days. Uh -huh. Save of the O king. He shall be cast into the den of lions. He shall be cast into the den of lions. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what else to say? Now, O king. Now, O king. Establish the decree. Now, you establish this decree. And sign the writing. And you sign the writing. That it be not changed. <laughs> it cannot be reversed. <laughs> see, see, ain't nothing new under the sun. Mm -hmm. Hallelujah. This COVID is just like the den. It cannot be reversed. It's been sealed. Firm. Read on. According to the law. According to the law. Of the Medes. Of the And Persians. And Persians. Which altereth not. It can't be altered. That's right. It cannot be altered. It cannot be changed. It can't be altered. I don't care who is in it. Hallelujah. I don't care your mama's in it. It cannot be altered. Read on. Wherefore, King Darius. King Darius. Signed the writing and the decree. He signed the writing and the decree. What did Daniel do? Now, when Daniel knew that the writing was signed, How? he went into his house. Because he knew. Daniel knew that the children, hallelujah, was in captivity right. down there in Babylon. Yeah. If he would have bowed, they would have killed all the Jews, hallelujah. He knew, so he had to bear the infirmity. He had a bird. He said, I tell you what, I'm not going to bow. I'm going to tell you how bold I am. I'm going back to that same window. Yes, sir. I'm going back to that same window, and I'm going to open it up. I'm going to let the world know, for God I live, and for God I die. Hallelujah. If God take my life, so be it. But I'm dying in his law. Yes, sir. Daniel did what? He now, when what? Daniel knew that the writing was signed, he knew the writing was signed. He went into his house. He went straight into his house. And his windows, and to his windows, being open, and he opened it in his chamber. Now he he called the people. They look, see see. If you ain't gonna bow, don't bow. Right. Don't fake bow. That's right. Wow. That's right. See, see, see. So it's right. You have. A lot of folk fake bowing. You know I me? Mean? They fake bowing. What you talking about, Ella Jackson? In front of us. In front of us. You know I me? Mean? They bowed. But when we went home, they closed the window. They closed the window. And when they closed the window, they said to themselves, I got common sense. A fake bow to, 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 to oppress the people. But they're not taking the burden on the people because time they went home, says Harry, they closed the window and said, God, I got common sense. They ain't got to see me, but I'm praying in the house. And started taking a mask off and call on God. Yes, I can. Yolomolo kandi la sanda, yolomolo kani yasa kamara yo, yolomolo chamala yasa kandi yolomolo sanda. You won't take it off. 
you think about it. Help me, Holy Ghost. Think about it. You ain't burn nobody, burden. You ain't spiritual. Open up the windows. Mm -hmm. He knew that the resorts. He knew. He knew he was going in the lion's den. Yeah. But he said, I'm not going to bow. Yeah. And when they seen him bow, they went and got him. Yeah. Didn't they get him? Yeah. Didn't they get him? Yeah. They went and got Daniel, yeah. didn't they? Yeah. They went and got him. Because right. the seal. You so bad, if God is for you, you see what you'll do in the lion's den. I'm preaching. Yes, sir. Yeah, you don't know I'm preaching. He don't get this everywhere. I'm preaching, mother. I'm preaching. Don't you bow. As long as you got my back, don't you bow. Right there, and you prayed. They bound him. Threw him down in the lion's den. Threw him down. Then they throw him down there. Y'all know the story. The king couldn't even rest. He couldn't even rest. See, see, see? Threw him on down there. Because people, see, God got your enemy loving you, and you don't even know it. That King Darius loved Daniel, <laughs> but he was an enemy. He had see the world. That's why the Bible said the world loved his own. See, he couldn't go against the world because he was the world. See, but Daniel was not of the world. So that's why he went against the world. Threw him on down there. I got off a little bit, but it's all right. Threw him on down in the lion's den. Oh, Daniel. Oh, Daniel. I heard Paul say, I fought a good fight. I have finished my course. The coppersmith, they did me much evil. Alexander the Great did me much evil. And I stood all alone. Nobody stood with me. Because I had a bear to burn. I had a bear, hallelujah, for the weaker person. So I had to go. And he said, notwithstanding, the, the, the mouth of the lion came to destroy me, but God delivered me out of the mouth of the lion. He repeated what Daniel proved. Oh, Daniel, did your God that you serve deliver you? See, this fact you be here. See, when you think, so when you're in the den, the devil think he got you. But one thing about it, God got a voice to bring you out. You down in the den. Oh, King Darius. Thank you. Thank you. See, see, you can holler out of the den. Oh, King Darius. The God that I said, shut the lion's mouth. Got to go down there. Hallelujah to God. Hallelujah. See here. Give me eighth chapter. Come on on in. Give me eighth chapter of Ezekiel. I mean, excuse me. Esther. Hallelujah to God. Hallelujah. Uh -huh. I'm coming on in. Look at here. See, see. Look at here. Now, the, the king. Hallelujah. Now I wrote a decree. Right. That cannot be reversed. Right. Hallelujah. But God got a counterattack. Now, what he's going to do, he's going to let you write a decree that cannot be reversed. To counterattack the one that was written. See, 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 you got to realize, see, when he went bow, he told Esther to go to the king. Esther said, I can't go before the king because I'll die. Mordecai said, do you think you dare? Just because you're there, because you're beautiful? You think you're there because you're beautiful? And you, you know, you're there for a reason. Because if you don't do it, God will have somebody else to do it. 
Don't you think you're going to escape because you're a Jew too? When they come around start killing the Jew, they're coming in that palace and kill you too. See, you got to be, we need some Esther's around here. See, you got to go before the king and say to your mind, if I perish, I'll perish. I know I can't go before the king because he's going to kill me. I don't care because I have to take the burdens of my people. See, Mordecai, hallelujah, he didn't bow. <laughs> but Esther had to come in, hallelujah, and bear too. See, she had to stand. See, she, see God always got people. See, it could be a preacher today. It could be a deacon later on. It could be an usher. It could be a cooker. It could be anybody, a lay member. After a while, it could be your turn to stand up for God. That's right. Amen. Amen. Because <laughs> you ain't going to, listen here. You ain't going to escape. No, sir. No. Because when the law come in here, he getting all of us. Yes, that's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Yes, sir. That's right. You think they're going to handcuff me and take me out and give y'all the house? That's right. That's right. That's right. They handcuff me. I'm going to turn around. That's right. That's right. That's right. I might do some jail time, but you're going to be on probation. So everybody gonna get if unless you say oh I was a visitor. <laughs> now how many visitors do we have today? <laughs> he told Esther, Esther say I'm going before the king. If I perish, I perish. But I'm going before the king. Hallelujah. And we went for the king. Hallelujah. I'm coming on in. I ain't made it, I ain't made it where you're patient. You know what I mean? But we went before the king. Hallelujah, God. The same trap that Haman did for Mordecai. Hallelujah. He died on the same horse. Hallelujah. But the decree was still out. And it been sealed. So Esther had to go before the king again. Go before the king and tell the king, you have to change your decree. But look what God did. Hallelujah to God. When she went before the king, tell Mordecai to come here. <laughs> Call Mordecai, the one that didn't bow. Call him. Look at here, Mordecai. I'm moving quickly. Look at here, Mordecai. Huh, I'm assigning it, but I want you to write the decree. Write whatever you want to write. Do you hear me now? When you don't bow, and it cannot be reversed what the governor put out, God going to give you a side people from a governor and let you write what you want to write to counterattack the enemy. Mordecai wrote a decree. He wrote it. Not the king. Mordecai wrote it. And he wrote exactly what he wants. Kill them all. Read the decree that he wrote. I want to hear that decree that he wrote. Verse number nine. Read it. Then were the king's scribes. Then were the king's scribes. Call. Call. At that time in the third month, uh -huh. that is the month of Anne, on the three and twentieth day thereof, and it was written according to all that Mordecai commanded unto the Jews. Look, it was written to Mordecai wrote to all the Jews. And to the lieutenants. And to the, to the lieutenants. And the deputies. And the deputies. And rulers. And the rulers. Of the provinces. And the provinces. Which are from India. India. Unto Ethiopia. Ethiopia. And Africa. And, right. A hundred. 27 provinces. All over. Unto every province according to the right. Every one. And unto every people. Every people. After their language. Everybody who don't speak my language, I'm writing it to your language. I don't care what language. All over. I'm going to write this decree for the whole world to let them know I got a decree here too. Amen. Read on. And to the Jews. And to the Jews. According to their writing. And to their writing. And according to their language. And according to their language. And he wrote. Hey. 
Mordecai wrote in the king Ahasuerus name and he and his he wrote it in his name and sealed it and he sealed it with the king's ring with the king's ring and sent letters and he sent letters by post by post on horseback horseback and riders riders on mules HPOs camels camels Yo UPS Way. Right. I'll send it out everywhere. Read on. And young dromedaries. Young dromedaries. Wherein the king. In the kings. Granted the Jews. Granted the Jews. Which were in every city. Every city. To gather themselves together. Apostolic folks, I don't care what city you're in, we write a decree. All the apostolic people. Yeah. Read on. And to stand for their life. To stand. Look at here. Apostolic people, you write a decree and it be sealed by the cream that stand for your right. Yes, sir. That's right. What you talking about, Bishop? Stand for holiness. That's right. Yes, Amen. Amen. Read on. That's it. To destroy. To destroy. To slay. To slay. And to cause to perish. Look at here. The same thing that they want to do to us, we're going to do to them. Right. I'll write it this way. They're slain to destroy, to perish. And all the power of the people. All the power of the people. And promise. And promise. That will assault them. That assault them. Both little ones. Little ones. And women. Women. And to take the spoil uh, take of, the spo of them for a prey. I take them for a prey. That's right. That's and right. guess what? And guess what? He said, he said, I'm going to take them for a prey. See, they took us for a prey and went and started drinking. We take you for a prey and go and rejoice. Right. <laughs> the Bible said they went and rejoice. Why you rejoice? Because I count of all joy. All right, all Hallelujah. Right. I count it joy. Hallelujah. You thought you had me, mm -hmm. but I got away. Yes, sir. Hallelujah. God made a counterattack. Yes, hallelujah right. to my. Hallelujah. See, you, you got to understand, this battle is not yours. That's right. It belongs to the Lord. Yes, sir. So I want you to have some confidence. All right. God got a decree. Mm -hmm. And he's going to seal it with the Holy Ghost. Right. Think about it, beloved. If we were to close the church down during the COVID, you won't be in here. If I stop preaching, we won't be here. If you stop coming to church, you won't be here. Even though the governor tell us, even though you called me and told me what they said, and I really didn't care. I listened. But I had listened further from the governor to listen to the Lord. Mm -hmm. The Lord told me to tell you he will cover you. I don't care you catch the COVID or not, he's still going to cover you. Well, I caught the COVID. You had to go in the den to holler out and say you thought you had me. Somebody had to be the witness. Oh, y'all, y'all, y'all see Somebody had to be with the COVID. The hollow out said he thought he had me. See, you, you see, you had to have the right response. The wrong response is I should have stayed home. That's the wrong response. The response is God deliver me. Oh, Jackson, you got the COVID. I did the devil. Did God going to serve save you? Yeah. I ain't got no taste. I ain't got no smell. But I got glory. I got the Holy Ghost. And I'm going to pray his name. <laughs> I sure am. He delivered me out of the mouth. But somebody had to bear the burden. He that is spiritual. Let us bear the burden of another. Take enough love. Don't think about yourself. See, 
if we close the church, mm-hmm. AZ will never receive the Holy Ghost. Right. Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes, sir. So catching the COVID was worth getting her saved. To me now, to, uh, uh, to me, to me now, nobody to you now, you know what I mean? Because we got fake bows. Pat, you know what I'm talking about. They we ain't serve her in a hospital. They we ain't serve my baby. In the hospital. That's right. She called me, they wouldn't even look at her. Now who else you gonna leave? Who else you gonna need? If the doctor, if the one who made the law don't look out for you, who gonna look out for you? Yes, sir. Jesus. Sitting in the hospital by herself. Nobody come see her by her because they didn't want to get contaminated. And the church is a hospital. Y'all, y'all don't believe me. Y'all, I mean, y'all, y'all take, take, take a light. I don't, I don't care about no kind of disease. Not in the church. You think I'm going to stop you because you got a disease to come to church? In the sick among you. Ain't that the word of God? In the sick among you. Call on the elders of the church. And the Bible said, He anoint your head with oil. And a prayer of faith. How in the world are we going to anoint somebody with oil if you don't come to me? And how can I anoint you with oil and I got fear? I don't fear. I mean, God didn't give me no spirit of fear. I don't care what kind of disease you got. If God can cast out demons, what of the disease? And he told me, don't rejoice because the spirit is subject to you. Rejoice because your name is written in the Lamb Book of God. That's why I rejoice, because my name is written. I got a job to do, and I'm going to perform my job. And my job is to heal people by God. Save people by God. Open up the door so people can come in by God, because he added to the church then. I'm just a vessel. In the way you use me, God, I'll be satisfied. You put me in the position, I'm going to take advantage of it. I'm going to use it to the best of my ability. What are you to having power and you don't use it? I am the Avenger. Ain't no kryptonite can kill me. I serve a God got the whole universe in his hand. I told the Lord way before he put me in the position, I want to be the anointed pastor, the anointed preacher that ever on the face of this earth, I will be one of them. That's my heart desire. Not nothing else. I want to be the anointed one. I want to be the one that you use in this last and evil days. I want signs and wonder follow us. Because I believe you. I trust in you. Everything that you say, I'm dumb enough to believe it. You don't prove yourself to me. I can't back up now. I know it's coming. I know the devil don't get a decree against me. So be it. I got a reverse one for him. I got his master in my hand. I got his boss in my hand. Hallelujah. I got the Holy Ghost 
I got God on my side. If God be for me, he more than all out against me. I don't feel what man do to me. I know he's coming because he can't reverse the decree. He come to steal, kill, and destroy. I can't change that. But I heard God say, I'm abused thou serpent head. Now he gave us power over all the enemies. I'm just like Paul. When I reach my hand down to touch somebody and the serpent bite me, I'm just going to just shake it off. Be careful, Bishop, who you touch. I ain't worried about it. Just, circle, just shake it off. <laughs> Hallelujah. I'm going to come on in. I'm going to come on in. But I feel good. Because God is good to me. He is good to true vine. Apostolic Church of Christ. I know, I know fear come above you and you get scared. That's, that's natural, you know what I mean? But I'm a bird, a burden. I'm a bird because I ain't going to bow. I ain't going to bow. I ain't going to bow. Flesh gets scared, but the spirit is strong. All the flesh, all the flesh, but the spirit stand up in me. I got you. Don't you worry about it. I got you. Just stand right there. I know they're coming against you, looking like you're crazy. I know they're looking at your church like you're crazy. But look what I have done for you. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Just look what I have done for you. I've been blessing you from day one. Yes, sir. Y'all don't even see it. He's been blessing us from day one. Ramonda, when you came in here, that was the best thing that ever happened to you. Don't let the devil fool you to get on out of here. Because you can't never find a perfect church. And you never will find a perfect church. But you find a perfect God. (laughs) Hallelujah. Don't worry about it. It says what? Let us what? Bear one another burden. That is spirit. More than the meekness. And then you have fulfilled the law. When you don't bow. You're saving somebody else's life. If I see you bowling, then I know. I ain't going to talk about you that you bow. I know you weak. So I'm the one with the spiritual one. I'm going to stand before you. I'm going to say, God, don't, she don't know. Like Stephen said, they don't know what they're doing. I'm going to stand with you. God, have mercy. Because sometimes you got to take a beating for somebody else. Y'all didn't hear me now. See, nobody don't like to take a beating for somebody else. You got to take a beating for somebody else in this Christian journey. You have fulfilled the law. Love thy neighbor as thyself. Then you would know that you are my real disciples. In Jesus' name, may God bless you. Have a most marvelous.
moved everything out. And we, yeah, we had that. I moved it out.
People has been diagnosed with the COVID, but don't have no symptoms. tells me that you scared of somebody else. We quickly say you got that stuff. Saints, understand but don't get to the point that you're scared to fellowship with each other because somebody knows it's running. You got a snotty nose anyway. I know y'all like, they don't like, see, they, they don't like me talk like this. They don't like me talk like this. Here we singing, shouting, because when I received the Holy Ghost, I was snotting, spitting everything else, crying. My nose was running. I was on my knees turning. I said, my daddy was with me. I called on the great name of the Lord. I call on his name like never before. But when I came back to get restored, I sit in the second seat over there on 48th Street. Lord, restore me. And I called on his name. My daddy used to walk past me and say, clean his nose. It wasn't no shame in my game. It wasn't no shame in his game either. He just said, clean his nose. But he didn't tell me stop. He just said, clean his nose. You clean somebody's nose now, you gotta get full now, you gotta get a everything, you gotta, you gotta get a technical shot. <laughs> Rabies shot. They treat you like a dog. Y'all stop that foolishness. Let me tell you, let me, you know, you got to do what you got to do. But serve the Lord. Amen. Serve the Lord. Don't be scared to serve the Lord. Y'all back there playing on trombone, spitting everywhere. No matter tell you put the trombone down. And you're spitting everywhere. You're spitting all in the mic. No matter tell you put the mic down. We ain't been we ain't been cleaning the mic. Now we spread a form of fault. <laughs> well, time have changed. Church never changed. Time have changed, but church never changed. 
You got to come around the altar and call on his name like you never did before. You have to cry out to the Lord. And when you cry out to the Lord, you cry with tears. When tears come, snot come. You can't separate the difference. We're so technical now. So high class. Don't know how to spell high class, but you high class. <laughs> Taking medicine, you can't perf- you can't pronounce. Only thing you know is about a number. One, two, six, nine, eight, seven. You call that in. <laughs> you calling in the number. Look on the look, look on the left hand corner of the cab uh, of the of the capsule and giving the number over there. Don't forget the name because you can't pronounce it. Where to get that name from? <laughs> All right. Ah. Hurt myself. We thank you. May God smile have it upon you. Hallelujah. Thank God for your baby. Glad to see you in Jesus' name. <laughs> praying, for you, praying for you and your family. You hold on to God and change your hand. Keep coming. Keep coming. God bless you. Hallelujah to God. Praying for you too. You know what I mean? Don't need to hesitate. Just get busy. You be like you go, like you know, like you really going somewhere. You either going somewhere, you here. You know what I mean? <laughs> My will, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna push you. My will join you. You here? You you looking all around, looking at us? Yeah, don't turn your head, Bill. You hear her talking to me? Hey, <laughs> <laughs> uh, you my way. You my way. You my way. Get the full blessing. Why get half blessing? You get the full blessing. Baby, you get the full blessing. I'm telling you, you get the blessing plan. I learned that. I learned. Hang around with the blessed one. Might not be everything that you think you're going to be, but you bless. You can't be a blessed individual. Only thing you do with a blessed individual is get mad. And promotion don't come from the east, from the south, from the west, or the north. It comes from above. God bless whom he want to bless. Ain't got nothing to do with it. Nothing to do with it. And the church is blessed. We are blessed, and they ain't got nothing to do with it. All right, we thank you. We, we, we finish everything? I'm done. Okay. We think we'll be here uh the good choir rehearsal tomorrow. We're going back to our regular service. We're going back to our regular service. The first of the month, the Lord then the, the next month, then we'll start uh, uh uh changing our schedule. Not changing the schedule, but we're gonna add on uh to the schedule in Jesus' name. Cause we know we gotta start a Bible study. You know what I mean? But we won't make sure everything right. You know what I mean? So just give us a uh I'm giving you a month. Uh, to recuperate. You know what I mean? All right, then you can get a month to recuperate. And you can get ready to serve the Lord in beauty and in holy. Come on, give God another praise.
I know you joined the church now. <laughs> I know you got a room. Room, I got a room. Room, I got a room. She's going to join the church now. She called her man. Hello? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can you willing to obey the rules of regulation of the church. <laughs> uh, I do. Okay. Let me get a right here, fellowship, please. <laughs> uh, hey, okay. Uh, the the um the carpets will be coming the 24th. That's next, next Tuesday, next next of uh, following week. Okay, this this next Sunday, then the following Tuesday. So um, next Sunday, uh, the brothers, when y'all come to church next Sunday, bring your sneakers or something because we gotta take everything out of here again. We gotta strip the church out. Everything gotta come out. Tables gotta go down. <laughs> 